They say it's your birthday. My birthday to ya. Yes, Marcy is starting her birthday celebration early today with the beginning of a new Wine Wednesday segment. Yeah, she already is popping. She's already popping bottles. Absolutely. Crazy. <laughs> she's at Hawk Ridge Winery in Watertown this morning to show us around. Good morning. Happy birthday, Mars. Good morning, you guys. Thank you so much. I have to say, I'm used to having everybody on the other side of the camera. I'm not used to having an audience. Take a look, Jeff. Let's turn it around so they can see. Oh, don't turn around. Don't be bashful now. We've got some of the crew here at Hawk Ridge Winery. We are so excited to kick off Wine Wednesday here with them. I'm live with Maureen. Good morning. Good morning, Marcy. Okay, so we, you knew that I was a little extra, right? So you brought out the glitter wine first, which yes. I'm obsessed with. Take us through what's in here. How do we get the glitter in here? Yes, so we take some of our most popular wines. Okay. We can also glitter on demand if somebody really has something Love they that. would really prefer. Yes. And we do add a completely food safe glitter. Okay. Um, so each bottle gets individually done. Everything here is done by hand, regardless of glitter or non-glitter. All of okay. our wine is bottled and made by hand. Amazing. Um, we think it's just something really fun for the holidays. It is. It just adds that extra sparkle. Exactly. And makes it so much more fun than just a regular bottle of wine. Absolutely. We love to offer wine as Christmas gifts, right, to all of our yes. friends and family. But this is the perfect gift for somebody who has everything or has an extensive wine collection. I bet they don't have glitter wine. I bet they don't. I love it. Okay, so for anybody who's been living under a rock and has not visited you yet, tell us what Hawkridge is all about. So Hawkridge is definitely all about family. Um, two local families created the winery about six years ago. We opened up in 2017. Okay. I've had the privilege of making the wine here ever since we opened. Love We're it. really, really um, happy to be here in Watertown. We have a lot of events and programs, yes, so it's more do. than just wine. And if you do have someone in your life who enjoys coming with you to wineries but doesn't enjoy wine, that's okay. We offer beer. We have fabulous wine slushies as well. Yeah. Okay, since you pointed that out, let's come on down and okay. show them the wine slushie and like maybe we can take a little taste test yeah. too. Okay, we have three flavors going on right now. We do. Okay. We actually have four right now. Oh. Yes. So for we the holiday to. season for November, we're offering pumpkin pie slushies. Okay. We also have apple cider slushies. Okay. Made with real local apple cider. Since you're such a pro, I'm going to have you hold the mic okay. and continue talking and I'm just going to get a little sneak peek. Yeah. Okay. I love so it. So we, this is the pumpkin pie one? Yes. Okay. We also have a red sangria slushy and a peach slushy too. Oh, yeah. I love it. And is we can twist them or swirl them if you want to try different flavors. The pumpkin pie is great with the apple cider. <gasps> this is so good. good. I love it. It has a, a perfect amount of spice in it, but it's not too overpowering. And then it's just so refreshing because of the icy. Great. Yes. Oh, I'm glad you enjoy it. You're like, obviously it's the best because it's from here. Now, when you have a group come, they try wines, they learn about it. What is that like for you as somebody who's really working behind the scenes that curates all of this? Is it just so gratifying? It's the best part of my job. I'm not going to lie. Aside from, you know, getting dirty and having fun with my assistant, making all the wines. Right. We really, really enjoy interfacing with the public and teaching them about wine. And a personal goal of mine is to take the pretense out of wine. Wine should be approachable. It should right. be fun. It shouldn't be intimidating. People should have exactly. fun with it. And you exactly. can tell that you guys have a lot of fun here. The energy already is so great when you walk in. And it's so versatile. You could have a wedding here. You could have a birthday party here. You could have a little bonding with your coworkers. Get Lose get to know them over a couple glasses of wine, right? Absolutely. We have lots of events. We welcome groups. We have a wonderful private loft that sits mm -hmm. up to 60 or 70 people. So it doesn't matter, you know, how big or small your family or group is, we can accommodate you. Yeah. We also have a beautiful tent outside that sits 300. Wow. So certainly, you know, no matter how large or small your business is or yes. family, we can accommodate you. Now I know in the next segment, we're going to do a little wine tasting, talk, talk about the wine and how it all comes together. But this is going to be very hard for you, really. What is your favorite wine here? Oh, I know boy. it's like picking your favorite child. You're probably <laughs> getting a little much anxiety, but what? any preference? I'm probably going to have to go with our Mohawk Sauvignon Blanc. Okay. That is Ooh. my absolute favorite. I am a savvy bee girl, so I like, I like this. I like where we're headed. We're going to have to have some. Yes, absolutely. <laughs> All right. Well, thank you so much, Maureen. Guys, we have so much more coming up on our Wine Wednesday. We have our long segment coming after this, so stay with us. So much more to cover and drink. Uh -huh.
<laughs> happy birthday Thank you so to much. you. Happy birthday to you. That was the first thing I did this morning was send her the Stevie Wonder version of Happy Birthday. Oh my God, I love that. That is so awesome. Great job. Yeah. All right.